Green light, let's get it. I'm the future, I'm in it. Check score, I'm winning. Green light, let's get it. I just win, 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 win. I'm on 10, 10, 10, 10, 10. Hello, I'm Himothy. I got the recipe. I got the flow. I got the remedy. I know they know. I know they envy me. Feet on the floor. What they gon' say now? We came along from last place, bottom to top at a fast pace. Out of this surf, I get touched down. I take a loss, get it back eight. I'm in the gym putting numbers up. You never there, you got bad traits. Never excuses to cover ups. Learn from the losses and bad breaks. Green light, let's get it. I'm the future, I'm in it. Check score, I'm winning. Green light, let's get it. I just win, 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 win. I'm on 10, 10, 10, 10, 10. Green light, let's get it. I'm the future, I'm in it. Check score, I'm winning. All this talk about who's on top and who's not. Miss me with the gossip. Check the score. Yeah. Ha! See me coming off the screen. No, I gave myself the green light. Catch a shoe from the three. If I'm not the one, it doesn't seem right. I need like two, four, five, six in them rings. I'm talking back to back to back like 23. Green light, let's get it. I'm the future, I'm in it. Check score, I'm winning. Green light, let's get it. I just win, 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 win. I'm on 10, 10, 10, 10, 10. Green light, let's get it. I'm the future, I'm in it. Check score, I'm winning. Green light, let's get it. I just win, 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 win. I'm on 10, 10, 10, 10, 10. Is he going to keep smoking up in this place? Because I can't stand for that. You see, I shop in Brindleton Bay, but today I thought, why not come to this quaint little shop in Evergreen Harbor? But all of a sudden, I walk in here and I see that it is pretty bogus because why are you guys smoking up here? Crystal says, ma'am, it's legal to smoke in Evergreen Harbor. Is it your first time here? I can't tell him not to smoke. Sir, is it okay if we just be nice to the lady since she's not from town and not smoke here? Eddie says, mm, I ain't giving her no favors. I don't know who she is. I want to speak to your manager right now. Okay, ma'am. I can't be around smoke. I'm allergic. I'm going to get sick. Oh, my God. Oh, oh my God. Crystal says, oh, ma'am, I'm so sorry. I just cannot do anything about that. If you want to shop somewhere else, I totally understand. Just this is the rules of this place. Mr. P runs it, and we just follow the rules Mr. P gives us. Crystal's coworkers are outside sitting down. Cameron is feeling a little guilty. He says, I feel like we should be helping her. And Chase is like, mm, we're on our break. And honestly, we can't do nothing much when a Brindleton Bay customer comes in. They are just too snooty to deal with. You know, just let them talk and go about your day. Sir, can you put your smoking thingy down? Eddie says, ma'am, do what you want. You don't gotta tell me what to do, okay? Yes, I'm not gonna smoke now. I'm probably gonna smoke in two more minutes from now. Who knows? It's my day. It's just how I feel. And obviously, this lady is not feeling Eddie, so she gonna throw that purse on him and say, damn you and Evergreen Harbor, you trash city full of trashy folks. This is Crystal's current reality. Rude customers, a job she doesn't like, the clothes don't even like look nice that they're selling. And she just imagines the day that she can say, I quit, and like just lives her best life and does whatever she wants. She just imagines herself in that Tartusa beach sometimes. Like she believes her future is so bright. And so her coworker, Kareem, is like, Hey, I'm sorry I didn't get to talk and tell that lady off, you know, but I was just not in the mood for yelling customers. We just had one of them like yesterday, and it's just so weird and so entitled how some people think they could talk to us just because we work here you know and sometimes these out-of-towners just look down at us i'm so sorry i wish i just had the strength today to say something and all of this is temporary right and he says yeah no i don't see myself like you know working here in the long run 
so at this point everyone is already clocked out and it's just crystal just you know making sure everything is restocked and you know everything is going well with the inventory you know like i said she closes the shop and she's the last one there she's about to you know step out and go home to her family you may notice there's a sim outside standing and you're like who is this well it's crystal's co-worker well actually i say crystal's co-worker it's crystal's boss to be exact and crystal doesn't notice her boss is here she's on the phone like hey Mello, you know i'm on my way back home i just had the longest day but you know, he's like hey hun don't worry come back home i'll run you a nice bath don't worry about it i'll give you a massage and crystal steps outside and she sees Mr. P and she's like hey Mr. P what you doing out here and he's like hey Crystal uh, you're forgetting and she's like what am I forgetting and he says uh I, you told me you were gonna take in my cats because my partner is allergic she's like oh my god sir like I had a really long day and I'm like please can this be another day and he's like oh no no she's gonna kick me out of the house if I don't you know give you these pets today I feel like it's best you know that I do this and you've agreed to it and you know you said you're gonna keep your word and you always do and i trust you so much with the shop please crystal you know and she's like okay sir and so she's gonna take these cats and she's like okay i guess i gotta call a taxi today instead of like you know taking the bus home like she usually does now she's just kind of like annoyed she has to stay in the shop a little longer she's on the phone with her cousin aja and she's telling her the situation with her boss and she's like hey like i could take one of the cats and she's like really and she's like yeah yeah i could do that for you don't worry she's like oh my god that would take the load off of me you know and she's like yeah well you know i already live close to the shop so i'll just walk and pick up the cat and Aja comes to pick up the cat and I feel a little bad that Rari and Fairy are like you know separated but at the end of the day they will you know at least have play dates together because they're living in two cousins homes and now it's time for Crystal to go back home and let's start this episode hey i'm sasha welcome to my space if you don't know this is the climb let's play it's a let's play following mellow and crystal rogers they recently tied the knot and they live in evergreen harbor the struggle town in my mind i've made the city to be more grungy just more you know i know that the game already has it like that but like i used more custom content to like really uh make it like a look away but not only that but of course some of the debug objects to make it look musty and you know some of those objects from like the other packs to just combine it and really give it that like musty feel <laughs> okay but like it, i hope you saw that like it shows there's cracks in the building some of the buildings are old they just like you know it's like really like not really taken care of the pollution is bad i don't know if you saw the air is just so yellow yeah so my sims are starting from the bottom it's like a rags to riches type of gameplay so they don't have much but they're gonna they want to be celebrities they're gonna be big one day and i see it for them as long as the save keeps working i'm so sorry again it took a while for this episode to come out because I went through the worst save corruption. My sims started disappearing. Residential lots became completely unfunctional. Infinite loading screens. Just a battle. And so I just had to go through two months of just finding out stuff. Not only that, but I had to do makeovers again. I had to repeat gameplay again. I had to just do all that stuff before recording and feeling comfortable to release this episode so yeah let's just go ahead and get into the episode we're gonna start the next day and just like let crystal sleep it was quite a bit of a stressful day at work for her like we already saw so yeah let's just go ahead and get into that don't forget i'm on all social media platforms so you go ahead and follow your girl there so you can get updates not only on this let's play but just everything that i'm doing in game we're in game right now and i just felt for the first time it would be nice to set uh, alarm for my sims and because they're students they just have things going on in their lives i felt why not like just have them on a routine so i think a good time for them to wake up is 6 a.m in the morning and on the dot six on the dot so yeah manage maybe here so i'll do monday tuesday wednesday thursday friday honestly Melo does have to wake up early but i feel like he don't mind going to work late just to sleep in because he's probably doing that every single day especially being in his school and everything okay he wants to use the bathroom them. um i want them to woohoo <laughs> and if you're wondering girl what okay look they have the thought both of them to woohoo so if you see right now crystal says she wants to woohoo from being a physical touch sim wherever 
whenever we're meant to be together click on any available woohoo spot basically it's for my mod called the love language mod he wants to tell her that he's in love with her so he goes i'm in love with you it's time i admit i'm so madly in love with you and he just has to profess his undying, uh, undying love so after he's in the bathroom and i have him wash his hands i'm just gonna have him go there tell his wifey he loves her so all right so where are you going hon Oh, she wants to talk to Gwen. She's like, hey, Gwen, how are you doing? Oh, my God. Speaking of family members to introduce, I need to introduce y'all to, oh, the cutest thing ever. Okay, so I thought Rock was awake and starting his morning, but looks like not yet. So you're meeting the newest fate that member of the family. If you remember on my community tab, which I hope that you see a post in front of y'all, I asked cat or dog, you know, what should be the new family member? And you voted cat and right now you're meeting fairy and fairy does have a sister in the save mellow i would sister. love if you could just profess your undying love to your wife and and then y'all woohoo he's actually thinking of woohooing with her so they're both going to complete their wants just like that and that's just kind of how they want to start their day a little different from how i usually start my lp episodes but hmm. you know so what that's what they want to do well, and we're just well, gonna go with it um so yeah let's have woohoo oh yeah so they're both about to woohoo and they have school literally in the afternoon i believe around 1 55 they're starting their classes and oh we're gonna be going to crystal's tutorial class today which i wanted to show you all quickly right now it's the art history students they have like a tutorial class after um class that they're supposed to attend together and it's not only for the art history but it's also for the fine arts so it's kind of like the art in general students so maybe i'll write art history slash fine art or something like that but yeah some of these students are in crystal's program some of them aren't um and not only that but crystal didn't really get to know the students she only just went to her first day of school i'm going to show y'all her outfit which i still have it for her actually in the categories so yeah y'all i'm very excited to be filming again it, like i said it's been a long time coming oh they're just so cute uh, all right Oh, she she completed hers too. I love that. And what's he thinking? Work on his awkwardness. So you know what? Let's have him do that. Because actually, I, you know, he has the words of affirmation, love language. And I mean, for somebody who's socially awkward, I feel like he wants to work against it. Oh, she's showing y'all her outfit for the tutorial class. Um, but I guess it's going to be her outfit for school today because she knows she's going to be meeting with other Sims. And like I said, I don't know if you know, but Jules Rico is the one who's running this right now. And there's quite a bit of rules for them to do. They're supposed to be friendly with each other. They're supposed to do gemology. They're supposed to write. Because again, I don't know if you know, but uh, Jules Rico is a writer um, and he works on fashion, uh, the fashion columns in La Da, you know? So he's actually pretty well in his well into his career for that. So there is that. And um, of course, you know, you're supposed to knit. So um, Crystal, she did have, if you remember last time, a couple of thrifty items um, because again, I had to roll back the save and work on everything all over again. I don't have those stuff anymore. So we're just going to do that together today. We're going to stop by the thrifty shop and we're just going to go ahead and go do some of that gameplay there um maybe we're gonna do that actually like right now because she does she has a pm classes today so yeah actually let's just go ahead though and clean this up they made some hot pot last last night and um again first day of school she went to work after class like oh my god I, she's a really she does everything bless her you know i'm gonna go ahead and like i said if y'all don't know but these two they do make their food usually like just something that just cooks itself <laughs> like they're not out here using the stove like that like the stove is there but like you know maybe today i'm just gonna have them make something because again they have pm classes and i kind of want to live like the, like this realistic student type of lifestyle for them and just you know have them sometimes work on some stuff so let's go ahead and have um mellow actually cook instead of crystal since um crystal's wearing her cute outfit and she's about to go out soon anyway so yeah let's go ahead and have him make some pancakes for breakfast because you know and he's lazy so i don't think of him making it from scratch but like he probably would be the type to be like yeah i have the mix like i mean he's so real because that's what i do Wallet okay hon so. you need a, oh he, he already <laughs> completed the one he wants to flirt with crystal from being a words of affirmation sim love that for him and you go ahead and hunt and clean this up and why don't you wake up little rock i do have a rock update for y'all which is actually just right here so right now rock actually starts to like stuff more i gave him uh the food and i guess he was like listen you know how wendy williams would take i'm a woman i changed my opinion <laughs> <laughs> i think it was giving pretty much that okay so let's just go ahead and give him oatmeal for breakfast and he loves it i love that he loves oatmeal like that's actually the one thing i wanted him to love out of everything or even just genuinely like kind of like you know anyway he's mixing it up and what is he doing 
Oh, he's chopping up the bananas. Oh, he's making a banana. Oh, I would not eat that. But look, he likes it. I love it. <laughs> oh, he just woke up. Even though he took like an early morning nap. But you know what? That was perfect. So parents got to do the little thing in the morning. Um, oh, the pancakes look so cute. Look, hey, Mello, you kind of snapped. Who remembers um, when Zaven cooks? He's always like so annoyed, though. <laughs> Like, that's all I'm thinking. Oh, he wants to talk about oh, oh, his interests to Crystal because he's a words of affirmation sim. And even in the game, for being socially awkward, he still kind of wants to try to flirt with her. So, yeah, like, like, like I said, he's trying to actively work against this stuff. Um, I don't know if y'all know, but they kind of want to be in their little problematic era. So I noticed that they both have the want to, like, be mean to sims. And I just find that to be quite interesting. So, yeah. Um, Rock, I believe he ate his food. I mean, I think so, because Crystal wasn't next to him. Let me go check his needs, though, just to make sure if he ate. Yeah, he did. Oh, he's still a little tired. Oh, he's giving a kiss to Papa. He's the cutest. I love him. So, yeah, there's that. And I'm really happy to be filming again. I Part of me thought I was going to have to close this series because I wasn't sure if things were going to work out for me. Not her autonomously using the PC. What is she doing? She's reading about university yeah. urban legends. You know what? I'm going to have her list skills that are important in fashion. Let's just say something like that. That's the article she's working on. And uh, Mello, I know you cooked. Usually I'd have Crystal clean, but, you know, she's doing her stuff. So just let her go today. Okay, Mello. And actually, before I get Rock out of here. Oh, I was going to have you eat. Look at my baby. No one wanted time to eat, y'all. Y'all want to see a proper look at little um, fairy my sister named her fairy by the way like my little sister she's so adorable she like she sims like i feel like lately a little more but you know my sister is one of those simmers who just plays and then just like doesn't play for months <laughs> but lately she's been playing um i'll say like the last month almost three weekends like she would play um, yeah, she's a, he's pretty much doing everything. I'm gonna have him have some coffee. And by the way, if you're wondering why, um, their Mello told his parents last night. Well, y'all, you know, y'all didn't see it, but he told his parents that he got married. And his parents were just like kind of surprised, but like a little disappointed because like he didn't tell them in advance. Like maybe they could have done something. I don't know. Maybe they would have had a small party in Willow Creek. But you know, again. But, Y'all know Mello, if you watched high school years, was kind of always doing his own thing. So they were just kind of like, look, we love you. We're just going to send you a coffee maker and let's just act like it arrived this morning. OK, so that's why they're using the hell out of it. OK, <laughs> so, yeah, we're just going to have him have a latte. So, yeah, let's have him start his day with a latte. And look, he's actually feeling great energy anyway. So, yeah. Oh, hey, Rock, how you doing? What are you doing? Just looking at his mom. It says that Crystal gained 75 followers from writing that post. Love that for her. That's good. Um, and what is she thinking about? She wants to talk to Mello. And what's Mello? Damn, that's me. And it goes, Law, did you really let your number leak onto the net? Haha, <laughs> just another dumb celeb. Mind you, he's barely a celeb. The fact that like his number got leaked is crazy. But anyway, we're going to find out who it is so that Mello can cuss him out. Because that's what he wanted to do for some reason. <laughs> I think that's probably where it's stemming from, like him saying that he wanted to be mean to a sim. Anyway, she worked on a bit of her aspiration so far. She didn't get trending blog. Um, and I'm going to take an energy drink with me. Um, it's in the fridge. If y'all don't know and you watch my other college series, you would know that her brother-in-law was living off of these, okay? Oh, um, sidebar, I did update this area all over again. And this is kind of how it looks now. It's kind of like the wedding fireplace. <laughs> that's just kind of how it is right now so you see it's mellow and crystal and their wedding topper and the flower that she was holding when she went you know and then of course their parents which i kind of felt like you know like it's, it's perfect like you know his side of the family her side of the family a union then they graduated school blase blase but yeah that's pretty much it um let's have crystal go so yeah, we're gonna go out with cousin Aja to the grungy laundromat that's here in the area. And it also has a thrifty location in it. So we're gonna try to wash some clothes on the property. Cause again, my girl don't have laundry uh, in her small apartment, honestly. And you know what? Two birds, one stone. Work on that fashion. Try to see how to get like a somewhat of a you know hot trending outfit for the trendy app because my girl has been you know hustling on plops even though yes i should be sending something to one of the you know buyers i mean sorry but yeah i i just remembered that and i left the property dang it don't worry i'll just send it later <laughs> oh this loading screen is by bougie chloe right now it's really cute i love it 
Y'all, do y'all see how busted the city is? Like, I need my girl out of here. <laughs> I do. Like, oh, my days. Oh, my days. All right, let's just go ahead and put some clothes in here. I don't know if her cousin has any clothes in her inventory to wash, but I do. So, yeah. All right, let's have her add the clothes to the washing machine. Hopefully, I could get this huh. stuff done, though. But, yeah. Oh, sorry. It's a little glitchy. It's because the floor I noticed is see-through. Oh, my God, the clothes smell help. Ooh, the city is something else, child. <laughs> there is an area for her son to be there. If she's, you know, sometimes I'll have him there. Oh, she's also doing some stuff. Hey, girl. So yeah, I own this one and this one. These two facing each other. All right, all right, all right. Um, let's go ahead and go to the thrifty shop right now and just try to like create something pretty quickly. Okay, I'm so sorry, y'all. I'm gonna take this spa, okay? Yafis uh, bar. Do y'all remember him from college years, the debate episode? That's Micah, the one who fought with um Khaled, I believe. Anyway, let's go. Oh yeah, for a second I thought I was going with a sim, and then I was like, wait, who's this? <laughs> All right, so let's go ahead and um, I'm using Sim Model Simmers mod where it like unlocks the clothes for all the packs. So I don't know how recent the packs are. Like, you know, I think, it, I'm not sure, I'm not gonna lie to you, but I do love this mod. So I'm gonna just have her create a look. Um, I'm thinking of doing something like maybe uh, a little like, ooh, that Joan Campbell got their stuff on, thr on, on Thrifty. Okay, maybe I might add something Joan Campbell mixed in. Okay, let's do this one. And then let's go find some shoes or sandals or heels. I'm surprised that Sentate stuff is here, but maybe it's just like a, like a, you know, thrifted, you know, Sentate stuff because I feel like Sentate stuff is quite expensive. But maybe that's where like Crystal can get some of her Sentate, you know, wink, wink, like a, you know, rich sim that just like don't care about their clothes. And it's like, you know, another man's trash is another man's trash you know treasure i was trying to say you know <laughs> but yeah sentate down i don't know sent she sentate down okay let's just say that <laughs> and um should i add some lashes you know what the random townie that gets this is gonna have some lashes on them you know what that's a nice gift and then let's go add some necklace I'm gonna add a little underwear just in case because sometimes like some skirts don't have underwear or like, you know, they're not blocked out. Like, you know how blocky the Maxis match mesh is. So yeah, um, yeah, I think I'm done. This outfit costs 225 simoleons. Do you think, okay, wait, they never really told me if the outfit's like tepid, like what? what's the quality? Ooh, it says style polished. All right, all right. Let's hope th there's a market for this. So we're back in the store. Let's go ahead and look at the quality of the clothes and okay, neutral. Y'all remember it was tepid. So this is this is an upgrade. Okay, y'all, this is an upgrade. Let's sell it. <laughs> All right, let's enter the price. Okay, 225, right? This time uh, um we're just going to keep it a little humble and do it to 240. Not that above asking point. All right, I was trying to do 300 or something before. This time I'm going to keep it sweet and like simple, okay? So she's just placed it right now up and um yeah. Okay. Oh, cousin is here. Oh, finally, girl. It took you forever to come here. Oh, oh not her clothes. No, not because I actually had some clothes in here. I know that's right. She she knew what she had to do here. Let's go and talk about um, Rock because she's just so happy that her son is just growing and just, you know, doing so great. Oh, hey, cousin. Oh, my God. You know, do you know the cutest little thing? Rock just started liking some foods and just feels like a miracle. Like, I was just stressing out. I feel like that's what she's saying. She's like, oh, I'm so happy. And that means you get to, like, you know, focus on you and do your own thing, right? She's like, oh, girl, I don't know about all of that, but for sure, I'll try my best. Wow. Oh, my God. I know what she's saying, actually, because I was going to tell y'all, but Aja has been, like, kind of a little bit, like, you know, I'll be honest. She just want to be in a relationship. Okay, I'll just <laughs> I say it. She's like, y'all, I'm so single. It's annoying. And she's like, well, hey, girl, if it's in the cards for you, you're going to find the right sim. But, um, you know, she's actually thinking of setting her up with someone because the way she just keeps talking about it. I mean, look at her face, y'all. Like, you know, she's sad. Like, she's sad. She's single. <laughs> so what we're thinking, we're, oh, yeah, I do have some updates on her cousin, Kaya, which, oh, my God, I cannot wait to get to that tea for y'all because it's like, all my days but anyway 
Um, I should have the temperature set to warmer because my girl Crystal's probably freezing. All right, there you go. Her outfit is cute. Hey, girl. And she got a tattoo. Okay. Now we're trying to clean up the area. She's so real. Anyway, so um, I'm going to go ahead and text the guy that um, she wants her cousin to go on a date with. It's her co-worker. Um, this is him. I'll just show y'all. He's so cute. His name is Kareem Douglas. And yeah, they're pretty cool. But not like the best of friends. But like they're just chill. And he um, he's single. So she's just like, wait, like, you know. Oh, is he in the area? No. <laughs> oh, my days. Oh, yeah. This is the barbershop up here. Where they could get their hair done and stuff like that. It's like, you know. It's an oh my god, I noticed that this one is a little glitchy. Help. Me Evergreen Harbor, y'all. <laughs> she's talking to Kareem like, hey, Kareem, I know you're single. Like, how you doing, though? And he's like, hey. She's like, well, I wanted to set you up on a date. And, you know, time's not on my side, though. I have to go to class. He's like, well, I know that. But, like, congrats. You know, you seem like you're doing well in work and everything. And she's like, yeah, I know. Thank you so much. It's really nice that you mentioned that. But hopefully, maybe I could set you up with my, you know, friend. She's really brilliant. And... Uh, I'm not in the mood to go to class, but I have to go to class right now. I'm already late. And he's like, oh, okay, no worries, no worries. Oh, hey, Eddie. I actually want to buy some base mental stuff from him, so... <laughs> That's kind of funny that he's there. Yo, I'm scared that she's, like, too late for class. Oh, my days. All right, y'all. Crystal is back from class, and so we're going to go to her tutorial right now. And I'm just going to have her take the taxi, quote unquote. But literally, I'm just trying to get everybody to be at the same location right now. All right, we are at the Foxbury Creative Space. This is, think of like a place where students meet up to do like tutorials outside of campus. Let's just say something like that. And yeah, it's like probably one of the campus buildings, but a little bit off pro campus property. Okay, so yeah, you can see it's like the Foxbury symbol. They got the Foxbury stalls here. Again, this area, like I said, I have the mind of every green harbor in my save to be completely very grungy a little unkept okay oh my god she's welcoming she's being welcome to the thing they're saying hey girl nice to meet you what's your name christy so today they don't really have to do a lot of work it's the first day but we're gonna have crystal work on that gemology and cutting like a gemstone or something um yeah let's do this and have her work and then we're just gonna have um jewels keep an eye on the students i feel like he might have already maxed out these skills and he should be keeping an eye I, i'm really annoyed that like the public is just being around here i don't mind if they're oh my god is that Bess? oh that is Bess. okay that's different the pu she's different that's his like that's his lady but like everybody else gotta go oh that's cute okay so i want to introduce you to some of the club members if y'all ever watched um college years x Quan was like there for the debate episode so yeah but also x Quan's just like in the background sometimes like i think he even crashed one of the parties so yeah this is x Quan. they're just such a cute sim i really like i think that it would be very nice for y'all to just get to know x i think x just has this like very interesting charisma and x has a sister and i think their sister's name is joy and like yeah that's pretty much him and then there is connor and connor is the oldest sim here i'm so sorry the camera's jumping but yeah this is connor he's the oldest sim here and this is a sim that actually one of y'all made i'm just gonna show y'all quickly so this is the family here the there it's drew and angel have been friends since high school they both share the love for entertainment they agreed when they turned young adults they'll move to the city and become famous celebrities together will this friendship last once they get into the limelight and they're made by ona 29 thank you so much ona for making these sims for me sorry that's pretty much connor right there for y'all and then there is carrie this is a sim i made her sister is opal so um you've probably seen her she kind of has a bit of a grunge like a maybe a soft pastel like punk kind of feel and her sister is different <laughs> they look very similar but different they both have like similar tattoos and actually her brother's in this club too so yeah and um this is her brother omari so they're two siblings in the same club and yeah i think she's in fine arts and her brother's in art history and this is the sim i don't know if y'all ever like subscribed that long but like um i had like a video for masculine cc and this is basically him this is omari and then this is another sim i made him in cast his name is rex um he was a random townie and um 
I don't know why, but like Araya said that like she found him to be attractive and Crystal was like, yeah, sure. But like, I don't think Crystal really knows who it is. Like that it was just this guy that's like happens to be in her tutorial, which I thought was random too, but like whatever, you know? And if you don't know, Araya is like her high school friend who lives all the way in Del Sol. So maybe she's doing some online dating or something. And then there is this sim, one of y'all made Christy Goldman. I'm going to show y'all right now. So Chris, Christy is a Foxbury student who's a host plus romantic navigating her way through the city. So this is made by Princess Dior 12. Thank you so much, Princess. Uh, right now, I have her. She's, by the way, actually, I, when I checked her info, she completed two degrees. She completed, I believe, the art history degree and the communication degree. But she's taking her third degree, which is a fine arts degree. I would probably assume that maybe uh, Christy just loves education. But not only that, maybe she just couldn't find the right career niche through the two previous degrees and thinks that maybe fine arts will help her find that. Let's just say that. All right. So that's pretty much the students. I believe you all met everyone. I think so. There's eight members in this club. So y'all met everybody. And again, he's not really part of the club. There might be more students added to the future. Um, but yeah, that's pretty much the tea. So we're just gonna have, oh, you're autonomously knitting like you're supposed to. I'm just gonna go ahead and tell Bess like, uh, thank you so much for dropping me off. He's gonna kiss her and then he's just gonna tell her to go. <laughs> Like, oh, all right. Cool. Oh, hi, Drew. Oh. <laughs> this is actually a sim by one of my friends. It's by Av. Hey, Av, this is your sim. <laughs> That's so cute that Drew's here. Oh, there's someone doing their homework here. Oh, there's a teen sim in the area. Okay. I wonder why the guys aren't Rina. autonomously wanting to do anything. I feel like Carrie is so far like Zip the most boy. ambitious. Yeah, she went from here, I believe, to here, right? Like, that's interesting. Oh, no, Crystal wants to pee. <laughs> Oh my god. And what's your energy like? Okay, her energy is okay. So she is working on the gemology skill, which is like a skill I want her to work on. I want her to work on the gemology skill, the charisma, the charisma skill, and I believe some more writing and... I forgot the blogging skill from the mod that's by Adib Indigo, of course. And then um, the entrepreneurial skill. Yes, there's a lot Crystal needs to do. <laughs> there is a lot, yes. And then I, knew, I know there's one more I want her to work on. Oh, the knitting skill, duh. Yeah, so she's stacked, but and she's thinking of inviting a sim over. So maybe um, I'm gonna have her invite her cousin over. I don't know. Eh, not 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 today. Sorry, girl. So he's checking up on all the students, making sure everything's okay. We're gonna go ahead and check with Christy how she's doing. He's doing, you know, deep conversation with Christy and Mello. Can you go back home, hon? Oh yeah. Oh my God. Oh wow, there's another sim who wants to buy something. So we're gonna put, go ahead and put everything uh, sent to when the, when she comes back home. But yeah, she's working on the gemology skill. Let's go ahead. Oh, oh yeah, Crystal has to go to work. She is late. Oh my god, y'all, Crystal's late on everything today. I might have to download a mod to do like faster gemology or something, only because time is not on her side. Is there a way to like come back to her project in the future? I guess next class on Thursday she'll come back and complete it, right? Yeah. We are back home. Mello is just relaxing. Didn't even take his shoes off like a menace. Oh my god. If Crystal saw that, like, oh my days. But you know, I'm gonna consider it just Sims being weird and not knowing their own house rules. When you come back home, so he should take it off. Come on, take it off. Take the shoes off. Oh. He said he's not- he, he, I think he has the mood light where he doesn't care about his shoes. Oh my days. It's just one of those days for him. We're gonna go ahead and have him help his son learn to crawl because I'm trying to get little boy aged up. His aunties are teen. One of his aunties is a teen now. The other auntie aged up. So you're the last one on the list to age up. You and your little auntie uh, Mariella, I believe, need to age up. So yeah. And then of course the little uncle too, but he's probably gonna age up after them. Yeah, we're gonna have him learn how to crawl right now. And what does he think about? He's thinking about writing a joke. I noticed that Melo's been into comedy, and I don't know how to feel. Like, should he just like become a comedian after he graduates or something? I don't know. I find that to be quite entertaining. He's been having like you know, because I'm t I've been taking care of him. I'm putting the timeline to this date, and I noticed he had a lot of wants about comedy, and I just find that to be interesting. You know, he even has dreams of being in the entertainer career, so. There is that to explore. Crystal's feeling quite uncomfortable. She needs coffee. Yeah, I'm telling y'all, she's she need a little pick me up. That's what she's saying. But the cat is sleeping. 
oh speaking of coffee olivia is like oh my god i'd love for us to meet for a coffee at 7 30 p.m though i'm judging her take your little teen self to sleep like <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> no but for real what is she talking about Mm -mm. all right can you can you crawl now what do you think do you feel comfortable what's he thinking gassy oh so there is that not follow the household shoe rules to his son <laughs> like be for real <laughs> Let's go and just like make sure feed formula milk. Please feed him some milk, please. And then let's just put him to bed because it seems like he's a little sad and tired. Um, actually, let's go and change his diaper. Oh, he doesn't need a diaper change. Let's do. Yeah, let's have him go to sleep. Seems like Melo is doing a good job taking care of his son, which I mean, der, that's like Papa stuff, you know. Hopefully the neighbors don't play music because I'm a little annoyed. Like I really am because they've been like annoying me. Yeah. Oh. That's a little Papa Mello. Okay, are you gonna have a good burp, hide? Because you needed it. Okay. He still feels gassy. Maybe he just needs to fart. Yeah, maybe I'll ha uh, maybe there's a button like I can look for like fart or use diaper or something. I don't know. We're gonna figure it out together though, of course. So um, I think Crystal should be back from work at 10 p.m. So I'll just see y'all then. So Melo is live streaming and he um, did some studying for his homework. Finally, Crystal is back home and she is having a mood lit about being into a group state while she was at work. I'm not going to lie to y'all. She did have a mood, um, not mood lit, sorry. Um, she had like a want and it was like a reactionary want, which is the third want where you can't pin it. But it was kind of like her wanting to quit her job she wants to be in the next chapter of her life and i know like we've talked about this before and like very briefly i believe but still the fact that it's like she's doing well in her job though like to be honest she is level seven of this career even though there's no such thing but you know what i'm saying so she's so trusted in her career she's doing pretty well for herself and you know she's even thinking about arguing now with a sim over like just feeling some sort of way i don't even know if there's anyone in the area to pick a fight with um but yeah she's feeling stressed from her work she is feeling the, gro the gross air like she just wants to get out of here okay and then she's feeling like she needs to drink coffee and she's addicted to coffee so um i'm trying to have her actually trigger the lifestyle for coffee drinking which is like um, I forgot what it's called, a coffee fanatic or something. I forgot where it is. Yeah, I think it's this one, the secret one. It's called coffee fanatic. I want her to unlock that one. I mean, I mean it's going to probably be very annoying, but why not, right? So anyway, um, she is feeling like she needs a little bit of caffeine, even though like she should be going to sleep. So I'm just going to ignore that want of it. Uh, what I'm going to do instead is I'm just going to have her first pay the bills because... Um, the bills just came in so we're gonna do that and then i want her to go get the mail and i want her to send these two um ooh, she's about to make a little over 100 simoleons i'm proud of her so yeah oh by the way i don't know if i told you all but when i put them in school i didn't make them pay with loans instead of them doing it out of the household funds because they're trying to focus on getting their first loan out and then their second loan aka their student loans later i might find a mod to make it a little more expensive and challenging for them but i don't know i don't know it depends i did send everything okay great great that's perfect so what i think i'm gonna do is i'm just gonna place this in her inventory and i'm just gonna have her make a quick little like meal so let's do that yeah she's gonna make herself some instant noodles she's gonna be like oh, i'm back you know she can hear mellow just like streaming and i'm gonna have mellow cash out actually because i think this is the time where um like, I think between Monday to Wednesdays, you're supposed to cash out. So let's just have him cash out. Yeah, there it is. And he made 3,155 yep. simoleons. Who is this guy? Oh, nice to meet you. His name is Mello, or if I'm playing as Mello. Well, my name is Mello. I stream whenever I feel like it, honestly. And nice to meet you. I feel like that's what he would say. <laughs> oh, 14,000 followers. Congratulations, Mello. Flavor Zoom! Oh, no, I'm celebrating it. <laughs> oh, my notification wall is full. You missed it, how? I agree with the last awesome. comment. He, I think he's streaming Stardew Valley. So there is that. Um, Crystal just having her meal with a fork. Usually she likes to eat with the chopsticks. Oh, she even said it. She's like, what am I doing? I'm tired. Not that tired. <laughs> 
Oh my god, let's have her clean up. And then um, I think I'm gonna have Mello stop streaming and I'm just gonna have him uh. clean up the litter box. Oh, I already had that set up. So come on, Wait, let's go ahead. You got no. things to do, Mello. Janelle. He has 193 subscribers on Switch. And I don't know if y'all know, but I uh, Switch sent him a uh, cup. Maria. Or. No. So it's kind of going up. I guess he's like the up and coming streamers. Let's just say that. For some reason, I noticed that he likes throwing the trash in this one instead of the one here. Like, I wish there was like something called kitchen trash, like other room trash or something, you know? Anyway, what? You're on my list of things to do today? I mean, she wanted to watch a movie and cuddle with him, but we're gonna postpone. We're gonna postpone. I would love that, but we're just gonna have to postpone it, Mello. I have to do my homework. Things are just not easy right now. And he's like, I get it, I get it. Don't worry about it. So I think what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna have Mello go brush his teeth and go to sleep. Yeah, and I set his alarm to wake him up at 6 a.m. So not only his alarm, but like everybody's alarm, okay? The whole home. Yeah, that's pretty much it. Um, and what's her first class? She has an 8 a.m., I believe. Yeah. yeah, she's about to finish her third homework. Um, I feel like she's just kind of like, I notice her classes. I'm, I'm going to assume she's going to get like a 60s or something. She hasn't really put a lot of effort. I'm going to be honest with y'all. I noticed that about her. So there is that. Let's go ahead and have her go to sleep, though. Maybe she could put more effort in like a day from now or something. So she's going to sleep right now. And, and Rock is already asleep. Y'all, I just realized I forgot to get the laundry. It's just sitting in the laundromat. And I feel like she's like, ah, I forgot the laundry. And Melo's like, okay, I'll go, I'll go. Don't worry. Um, he's thinking of flirting with Crystal first thing. <laughs> it's so funny. He's just like, don't worry, I'll go. So we're going to go ahead and have him just wear some sweats. And we're going to go to the laundromat right now. Like, oh my god, y'all, I'm so done. Let's just finish this laundry. I feel so bad. But yeah, it's okay. And he's hungry too. You know what? I'm just going to get an energy drink from the fridge. That's two birds, one stone type of situation. So let's do that. Open. We actually, Crystal has one in her inventory. Yeah, I don't think it expired. So. All right, y'all. We are at the laundromat. Huh? Not he teleported like the mod. Like, sorry. Like Zaven. And the mod is broken. So I definitely need to find that mod and update it dry the laundry oh it costs money it ain't cheap <laughs> oh he's so adorable <laughs> sorry but yeah y'all i'm gonna pretty much end the episode here for y'all and i'm gonna meet y'all for wednesday and thursday hopefully i can combine even maybe friday gameplay and we could just see where their story goes this episode wasn't super like crazy or anything it was just sort of like a mini second intro right because i feel like i've been away for a minute from this lp and it makes me really sad but i'm very happy to be able to upload it i'm not gonna focus on the sadness i'm gonna focus on the happiness like i always do at least i, I try to do child <laughs> Thank you so much for watching this and let's talk in the comments um yeah you got to see a little bit of their routine this time around so we'll see a little bit more in the future episodes more of the tea more of the mess because honey the cousins of crystal are messy boots okay i i knew they had it in them i just didn't know how much and i'm very proud of them and it looks like crystal wants to join in on their messiness too so we're gonna find out how because i really don't know the answer either so we're gonna find out together of course thank you so much for watching my name is sasha and i wish you all a lovely day take care